Hello everyone, my name is Rafiq Wayani, and I'm here to talk to you about Azure Stack and try to put Azure Stack in very, very simple terms. You may understand the cloud very well, and you may understand cloud technology and the cloud platform really well, specifically that it has IaaS and PaaS and SaaS, the infrastructure, platform, and software as a service. What if you uh, don't want the public aspect of the cloud all the time? You know what I mean by public aspect? You want the cloud and the resources of the cloud to be made available to you only when you desire, only when you need it. The rest of the time, you want to use the resources on premise. Let me explain that further. Let's say that you have an application that works just fine nine months out of a year. But on certain times during the year, you need that application to have more resources because of the increased number of users. Let's say during the time of taxes or during end of the year cycle in your organization. If you are any kind of an accounting firm or you do audits and such, maybe certain times during the month or certain times during the year, you need more resources, more horsepower associated with a given application or a given machine, machines, if you will, than you, doing, than you do during most of the time of the year. What if you want to host your application and your machines in your own data center most of the time, but sometimes you want access to public resources and you want a mishmash. You want to decide when you want to be private and which applications are going to be private and which applications will be public. Not only that, you want to be able to decide which ones will be private up to what time and when will they be hosted in the public environment during other times. If you don't want to invest tremendous amount of money and resources on um, physical infrastructure like hardware and like cabling, like servers, like licenses, like operating systems, like databases, like setup and such, only to accommodate a very small portion of your business, maybe two, three times a year, you have the need for that increased bandwidth. Azure Stack is perfect for you because you get to decide which portions of the cloud, IaaS, and PaaS you want to have access to in the private cloud within your own data center and you want to decide which pieces of the cloud IaaS and PaaS you want to have access to during the uh, certain peak aspects of the public cloud and you want to gain resources from that public infrastructure. So nine, ten months out of a year you can take care of your business on your own data center privately uh, and you can say two, three months out of a year, maybe you need that increased bandwidth and that increased resources. You want to be able to do that with a single click so that you can scale, right? You can scale your business as you please. What is the purpose of the cloud? What is the big benefit of the cloud? Well, the big benefit of the cloud is that it lets you scale to a degree that you would not be able to do so otherwise without extending, exerting tre tremendous amount of resources. So what is Azure Stack? Well, behind the scenes, Azure Stack utilizes Hyper-V and Hyper-V virtual machines as well as your storage infrastructure. Okay, what is Azure Stack then? Well, Azure Stack makes it possible for you to gain access to that cloud, Microsoft Azure cloud infrastructure at your own data center using the Azure Stack portal that has been made available to you on site in your own data center. Simply put, Azure Stack makes it possible for you to decide utilizing your own environment, your own private cloud, which pieces of the puzzle, the machines, the applications, the databases, the database servers, you want to make part of the public cloud and when and for how long because you have that increased capacity. Maybe you want a private cloud because you're doing it for development and testing. You don't want to use the public cloud for development and testing. You want to use a private cloud. Well, why is it the cloud? Well, behind the scenes, it is Hyper-V. It is Hyper-V virtual machines, and it is utilizing specialized hardware to accommodate Azure Stack. Well, it gives you a unified interface and a unified model. This is the cloud-inspired infrastructure as opposed to the cloud infrastructure, which means that when you go to the Azure Stack portal on your local data center, the interface looks very similar to that of the Azure cloud. You have access to compute, networking, storage uh, resources, okay? IaaS and PaaS, 
okay? as opposed to the public aspect of the cloud infrastructure. Okay? So Azure Stack makes it possible for you to decide and keep the pieces that you want private and things that you want hosted in the public cloud. Azure Stack. It is a great tool and it is exactly where we need to be as an organization. Thank you for watching. This is Rafiq Wayani. Follow me on Twitter, on LinkedIn, and on YouTube. Uh, send me an email if you please. And I am from itexpertwebinars.com. Thank you.